And breaking tonight, minutes ago, we learned 25 bodies have now been discovered off California's coast. Those victims trapped in a dive boat when it caught fire. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Curtis Ming. And I'm Adrian Moore. Here's what we know tonight. 25 people are dead. Nine others are still missing. The fire started at 315 this morning while people were fast asleep near Santa Cruz Island. CBS 13's Danya Beck is with how this all unfolded. A Labor Day diving adventure turned into disaster aboard the 75-foot Conception. The scuba diving boat caught fire in the early morning hours off California's Santa Cruz Island. Flames consumed the vessel, trapping some 30 people in the sleeping quarters below deck. The vessel full in global now. Roger, and there's no escape hatch for any of the people on board. Five crew members were awake and above deck. They jumped overboard in a nearby boat. The Grape Escape picked them up. As soon as I came out, I saw the man with the broken leg lying in the bottom of the dinghy in water. The burned out wreckage then sunk. The boat remains uh, unstable, and I'm not sure when we're going to be able to recover uh, those bodies as well as any more that may be within the vessel. Back on shore, family members hugged each other and waited for word. I think we all should be prepared um, to move into um, the, the worst outcome. The passengers on board were experienced divers, and authorities say the Conception's operating company has an excellent safety record. At that hour of the morning, most passengers were likely asleep in a communal area with bunk beds. There is a stairwell up to the galley, the only way out. Fisherman Jonathan Tafuga used to be a commercial diver on the Conception. Everybody on that boat is a, a perfect crew. Um, if anything could have been done to, to have a different outcome, they would have done it. It's not clear what caused the fire. Well, 20 of the 25 bodies found tonight have been recovered. The FBI is now helping with the investigation, and the NTSB has been dispatched to the scene.